How's it going, guys? How's it going, Merlin? Good to see you, buddy. Sorry about that. Just trying to deal with technical stuff on my side and failing miserably. How was your weekend? How'd you guys do? Um, not much for me, unfortunately. Most of my weekend went to working on the freelance work. So that's uh, unfortunate. I got a little bit of time to work on the game. Just a little bit. Not too much. Doing good over here and no worries. Awesome. Very cool. Um... Yeah, I pretty much worked all freelance all weekend, with the exception of taking time to watch out watch that amazingly exciting Super Bowl game. Mm. Yeah, <laughs> uh, you know that's that's irony at its best because I've been saying for the longest time all I want is for the game not to be a blowout. Normally, one team just destroys the other, and instead I got a a total snooze fest where nobody could figure out how to score. So, you know, be careful what you wish for. But, um, yeah, there's a couple of fun plays and a couple of good commercials in there. Um, but, uh, that was it. Pretty much most of it was freelance. Most of it was just tied up in that stuff, which, um, <clears throat> fingers crossed. I'm hopeful that that's wrapping up this week and I can get back to normal schedule. But until then, I'm still doing the lunchtime broadcast, which means that this, I'm already down to 57 minutes <laughs> left of this broadcast before I have to get back to the, to the paying stuff. So that's unfortunate. But glad you guys are here. Good to see you again, Merlin. And everyone else hanging out. So, um, <clears throat> if you remember when I was playing with this last, the thing I was trying to do was teach the AI how to handle being not only just the blue player, but also the red. And I believe I've got that worked out now. <clears throat> like I said, I did, I did manage to get a little time in the weekend to work on this. <clears throat> Excuse me. And if you remember when we... Uh, left off on Friday you can remember like the buildings were turned around the wrong way uh, no I, I, I might have fixed that but I don't know if I fixed everything in there um, and then you know the the launcher is facing the wrong direction and was shooting in the wrong direction but <laughs> recipes <laughs> but um, but yeah we're all good uh, this is all behaving nicely now so now the AI can play <clears throat> both red player and blue player which will help sort of like uh, camouflage if you're playing a bot which hopefully won't happen often but in case you do I want it to feel like you're playing a human he's not playing very well I can't remember all of it only thing I can remember was the healing spamming uh, yeah yep that was it pretty much that was it when just the face in the wrong direction kind of stuff but boom there it is <clears throat> yep but uh, yeah working nicely now that's we're in good shape now the only thing I did notice and I need to correct that now is when you play an online game and you go up against a bot it will reverse the colors of the characters uh, yeah that was quick <laughs> yeah like I said I got a little bit of time over the weekend just a little bit of time to play with it not much but uh, what I did I made good time with uh, so this I'll show you this this is still a mistake so when we pop up here, so I should be blue, but you're going to see this is going to come up, and you see I'm, I'm red, and the AI is blue. So this is reversed. Uh, it does this correctly, but the, uh, the winning-losing uh, menu system is wrong. <clears throat> the, uh, the versus screen, which you just saw. And then conversely, also at the end of it, I think what happens is that it incorrectly transfers the animation to the, the red character, 
So it, it plays the, the bot's losing animation, assuming he loses, of course, uh, to the my character, which is wrong. Yeah, I would love to say that I just fixed it just in those two minutes I was online, but I ain't that good. Not even close. <laughs> All right. So that's what I need to fix is just that menu screen. And here, I see if I... Oh, he's going to get it, isn't it? Oh, he got it. Oh, that was interesting. Okay, that's something I did j just notice, that the rebuild meter on the launcher is on the wrong side. It was, it's really subtle, but here, I'll show you again. <clears throat> if he'll finish... Unless he's going to destroy me, then I'm just going to finish him off here. Come on, buddy, you're going too slow. Nah, he's taking too long. All right, just take my word for it that the meter was on the, the flip side. So that's something else I got to address. I'll be respectful. And then now what will happen is that the losing animation will play on my character. So, see like that. So it's it's taking the correct animation, putting it on the other character. So that's I need to flip that. I just got to make sure that that's done correctly. So... I think that might be a simple one-line fix. I'm hoping. So, uh, see, it being a game controller, <clears throat> but the pants are wrong too. Oh, the, you mean the colors? If you're talking about the colors, then that's exactly correct. That's the case where the the red and blue guys are, are inverted, right? <clears throat> so yeah, if you're talking about the pants being the wrong colors, yeah, that's because they're on the wrong islands. <clears throat> Excuse me. Let's see. I think it's show versus menu. And it's probably all going to be in the main menu, or it's there. Okay. Menu script. Okay. Uh, opponent name, opponent level, opponent. Yeah, so it is in the main menu, and it is show versus script. <clears throat> All right, so we just got to figure out how to flip this correctly. Uh, let's see. Um, where's my reverse? The proponents, that's good, that's fine. Simulated. That's fine. Hmm. All right, where's my reverse then? This rotator active. Oh, here we go. For the host. Hmm. Okay. So, let me figure that out. Let me see if it's incorrectly showing me as host. to the bottom of this real quick. It's thinking, it's thinking. There it goes. All right, let me take this out of full screen so you can see my console log. Yeah. 
And it says we're hosting is true. Which, that's not actually the case. Okay, so th how did the hosting get flipped? That's interesting. Alright, so... is getting kicked off before then? Is that local game true? Ah. There we go. Shoot, because it's already being kicked off before then. I think that's what's happening is the fact that it's displaying the menu and then it's deciding if I'm going to be the host or not. So I think I have to do that before that point. That's my guess. Certain it's not that one, it's this one. Start, uh, select local game. True. Okay. Yeah, so we're going to decide it right here. <clears throat> I don't think I actually use it though. Okay. Um. Screen fixer. Okay, I think I can handle all that. Alright, so this is what I want to pilfer, and I just need to make sure that I kick this off earlier. I think that's what we need to do here. So, let's start with just this. I'm going to find out which of these are local values. No? Oh, let's see. Um... No, actually, I don't have to do that. No, um, I can still do that over there. I just need to decide the host here. That's what I'm thinking. Yeah. So then we're going to kill most of this. that for the moment. Okay. I think this is going to fix that issue. Let's play as red. And we're going to tell it it's going to be game controller. There it is. Okay. That's where I need to do it. Because that's exactly where that menu is getting shown. Bingo. So I was right. It's just the fact that the value for the host, who who is the host and who's the guest, gets decided uh, too late. So if we do it here, then we're good. Now if we come back to the game controller, and we'll say... Um, now all I have to do is change this to if host. Uh, and then I can delete this because it's got to be 
already established. So now, if we're host, do that. Otherwise, do that. I'm gonna play as red. Uh, AI plays as red. Okay. Alright, but just for the moment, I'm not going to let this randomize. I want this to be hard-coded so we know. It places red. Alright, do that just for testing. Yeah, that's good enough. <laughs> the garages are right, but the reversed. Crap. All right, so we need to do the island reverse on that. Uh. So we're not the host. I'm gonna say hosting is false. So we're not the host, so it should it does spin it around. Alright. I guess what I need to do is determine Um Alright, let me come at it this way. Hmm. It comes up. I'm going to pause it here. There it goes. All right. The rotator. So 29. So that's correct. And then the blue ninety. Yeah. What should it be? Oh, should be that. One fifty one. Yeah, one fifty one. Should be twenty nine. No. All right, I guess I could just hard code this. Might be the simplest way. So one fifty one, and he's ninety. So blue is 90, and red, I'm going to say 151, yeah. That's got position. Okay, good. 
think that's it. So then we'll say um, host is fine. It's, we only need to do this on the guest side. Make sure that's online simulated. Good. Okay, I'm telling it online simulated before I kick off this menu, so that should get the correct value here. Transform local. I can just borrow this. All right, and then blue I said would be 90, and then. Red equals 151. Excuse me. Okay. Bit of a hack, but it should address the issue. Let's see. I got 37 minutes to go. All right. Three, two, one. <laughs> Nope, instead we get an error. It has not been assigned. Mm. Okay. All right, that's fine. Mask got position is what I'm looking for. Oh, there it is. Okay, it's red mascot object and blue mascot object. There's the correct one. All right, that should do it. All right, fingers crossed. Feel good about this one. Let's see. Blue and red face in the right direction. No. Okay. Hmm. No, oh, because it's happening down there. Okay, we just gotta kick it off sooner. <laughs> Crosses his fingers. I, I was, it, it was correct, but uh, I should have done this sooner. Um, I mean, I don't think there's anything wrong with kicking this above here. Yeah. So I'm asking it to mess with objects that. didn't exist yet there so now it's finding it so now it should work all right this is done this is done this is it all right okay Blue is correct, and red is the wrong direction. I hit pause too slowly there. <laughs> it was close. That was close. I just got to figure out what the correct value is for red, and then we're good. So red mascot. Interesting. Did I not? Yeah. 
Oh, that's reverse. That's why. So then why is blue working? Negative 90. Hmm. Unless I'm transforming it somewhere else, too. Let's check that. Ooh, I might be. I was just doing it there, that's fine. Alright, let's try that. Is that what it wants? Then why did blue work there? I'm getting the I'm getting a sense that there's m something else transforming it, but I don't see any other code messing with it. All right. All right. And All right. This. Is better, but I still don't like the rotation. I think they're they're off. So red needed to go more. So we're gonna go full 180, and I'm gonna say 90. Uh oh, my alarm system just went off, which just means the neighbor somewhere within the next three houses closed a door in their car. Okay. <laughs> well, red is good, but blue is now, all right, so 150, did I go the wrong way? Gotta go. Good luck on the project and on the freelance. Merlin, thanks, man. Thanks for stopping by, buddy. No worries. Take care. Thanks for uh, thanks for checking in. Yeah, we're good there. So there you go. You did get to see it fixed at the last second there. <laughs> so we're all good. I'll do a quick playthrough and see if the reactions go to the right characters. If so, I'm going to mark that one done. Where are we at? Oh, yeah, halfway mark. Oh, come on. I'll nudge this full screen now. There we go. Now, oh, crud. I'm gonna mess with him. Ah, too late. Oh, come on, I keep overshooting. Look at that. There it is. All right. Now we're talking game over. Done. Okay. See you, Merlin. Thanks, man. All right. Do it respect. So we should have... <laughs> okay. The animations are correct. They're just doing it the wrong stupid way. <laughs> okay. That's fine. Let's see. So then, be in the game over section of the game controller. All right. Okay.
So versus menu set active. Let me just do it this way. Really? Huh. Okay. So then where am I? Is it versus menu camera? No. Versus camera object. This is game over, yes? Yeah. All right. So we're just going to drop it right in here. I'll add it here. Oh shoot, I got to do it. Um, and not host. I got to change that, don't I? Host, then I reverse it. There we goes. Okay. So I had it fixed working correctly for when the AI was playing as red, but until I just added that little host check, it would have been wrong for when the AI was blue. But we'll check this now. We'll do a check on both of them both when the AI plays red and blue villagers. All right, that's good. Let's see if we can burn through this real quick. Oh, he's doing some damage to me, too. Oh, and I missed. Stupid small ones. There you go. And done. Good. Okay. And we'll say respectful. Why not? And they're still facing the wrong way. Jerks. Hmm. So then why? Maybe 180. <laughs> All right, totally wrong on both counts. Red starting off as 180, it should be 
zero. And blue is starting off as 90 and should be negative 90? Yeah, negative 90. Okay. So, in theory, that should be just zero to zero. That's bizarre that it works right in that one, but not in the beginning. Yeah, it's so convoluted. I could go back and actually try and address it and clean it up, but it's working for all of them except for this one instance, right? where you're playing an online match against an AI. So I don't see a good reason to go back and update all of them when all the rest are working fine. So that's good. All right. Boom. Smack the ogre down there, too. Look at that. Uh-oh. I better go for that before he hits it. There you go. 99, boys. Oh. And how do I celebrate? By missing. Oh, come on. <laughs> Another one. Ugh. There we go. And now we're done. Boom. Okay. So respectful. Okay, so, oh, let me come back here and now check to make sure that works for both. And if this works, then I'll turn that off and switch back to random. And... Oh, crap. Alright, it didn't error, but it... Sent them out in the stratosphere or something. What the heck? That's bizarre. Okay. Huh. That was working, now it's broken. Well, actually, it would be not here, but back here.
Alright, if I'm assuming that it, that's good. Host. Transformed it wouldn't have like nuked it. All right, ah, 18 minutes to go. <laughs> Don't know if I'm gonna get this one in or not. Almost like it didn't even generate it. So there's the uh, positions for it, but it didn't even generate it? Or it just didn't attach it? That's interesting development. Okay. Oh, okay, I have a theory. Let me run this. Yeah, okay. So, show versus menu. Yeah. And if online simulated, set vector opponent icon. Okay, so that's fine. Wait for put icon. Um. Yeah. Okay. Oh, oops, let me reverse this. Otherwise, I'm testing the wrong thing. Okay. Let's see what we got. There we go. Alright. Oh, but no, actually, sorry. Blue and red is the one that's working. Come on, man. Pay attention. I'm waiting. Okay, so it's still not. Hosting set to true, which is correct. Okay. Alright. So we're not getting hung up there. So that's not the culprit. Oh, wait. Whoa, 
Okay, where did I? All right, that goes down there. Oh, okay. It was loading it incorrectly when it was read before. Put it there. Alright, so there's my rotate mill. Okay, okay, okay. So convoluted, but getting better handle on this now. Perfect. I think this might do it. No, okay. So, that's fine. I think we just gotta tell it not to do the uh, reverse that we have down here. No, if we are the host, rotate it. There it goes. <laughs> Get myself t so turned around on this crud. Boom. Got it. Okay. correct there. Let's see if I broke both of them now. They're going to be totally confused. Hmm. Ugh, got nine minutes left. This doesn't look good. All right. Red and blue are fine.
but then blue was turned around, but red was correct when it's reversed, I think. Yeah, oh no, actually both are totally wrong. Alright, I just put this back then. Online simulated, I'm not the host. I have to check the online version as well, but don't know if I have time here. Ugh. Oh, wait. Zero. We'll try that. <laughs> so I guess the trick is, is when you're making a game, you have to not only design what you're currently working on, but you also have to like predict in the future all the permutations you're going to do and make sure that you map that out perfectly from the get-go. And he's still wrong. Did I not say that? Main menu. 90? Now I'm just randomly guessing. <laughs> uh, I'm so frustrated. I got six minutes left. I'm bummed. I thought this was going to be a quick, like, the first 15 minutes. Okay. So he's good. Ah. Oh, come on. Right, there you go. We're on a roll here. Oh, just short. Mine. Good. Ugh. And we're, oh crud, and we're not done. Now we're done. There he goes. All right, I'm annoyed, so I'm gonna say disrespect. OP Scripter, how's it going, buddy? Oh, so blue is in the wrong direction, it's 180. How you doing, man? Long time no see. Good to see you. Yeah, I'm, unfortunately I'm down to my last four minutes and then I gotta get back to the, the freelance work, unfortunately. So actually that was correct the whole time. Huh. But, uh, yeah, how's it going for you, man? Did you have a good weekend? That's understandable. <laughs> the good news is I'm in the home stretch. Uh, I'm, I'm feeling, uh, been fine. Cool, man. Uh, yeah, I, I'm feeling confident that this week is going to be pretty much wrapping it up, which would be cool. Then I can finally get this one done. But this is a big deal. I mean, you know, T 
teaching the AI both sides and getting it like familiar with how to handle the villagers properly and you know adding all that stuff uh, I kind of knew it was gonna be a beast which is sort of one of the reasons I kind of been putting it off all this time uh, I've got a a printer I've been raging about th today though <laughs> it just says it's offline tomorrow I'll read the instructions <laughs> oh, I hate that you look at it and the printer says ready but then you look at it on the PC and it says offline I'm guessing it's something similar to that yeah that drives me nuts man you know because then you're dealing with like you know you're dealing with computers so there's there's no rational discussion you know I hate that man it worked last week oh that's even worse it's fine and now it's not on the first try it worked wow uh, yeah I can understand that all right and they're both facing the right direction good okay so that's good shoot I'm just about out of time but let me try this I might push my luck here Excuse me. all right back here All right, make sure that the red is still working correctly. And then I think we'll be okay. I'll definitely have to go back and check the online to make sure that that's behaving correctly since this is the simulated, uh, the AI play. But I think that's going to be fine. Okay, that's good. Cool, that's looking good. up through this to make sure that they're looking good when the game is over come on AI go for the uh, fog bank you know you want to there you go oh we got in the first try oh crud all right I shouldn't have taunted him but I kind of know where the buildings are anyways nope I missed that one over here somewhere nope missed that one too Why not? And they're both on the right side. Good. Cool. <laughs> All right. That's awesome. Okay. So I got that working. So I can mark that off. I'll double check offline to make sure that it's behaving correctly. Oh, you know what? I'll do it right now. Forget that. I'll double check right now. Documents. Fog Village. Builds. See, throw that up real quick. Um, wait, I just thought I saw a cannonball reflect back. Um, nope, that'd be interesting. Maybe that should be a, a thing for a buff. That could be kind of cool. Uh, something to think about after the fact. <laughs> um, yeah, that that was a suggestion too. I'm. I used to have it where the cannonballs would hit each other in mid-flight, but just because with the online play, you know, the possibility of lag just makes that impossible to, to make sure that it's going to behave correctly. Alright, so that's all correct. And... All right, I'm going to kill him, and then we're going to come back, and let's see. Yep. Good. That's good. And then finally, I'll check it the other way around. Okay. Online here and here. Sweet. And they're both on the correct side. Good. Okay. So, the good news is, is I think that's officially the end of me tweaking the AI. 
I think we're done there. And that's good. Whew. Your other work, though. Top secret projects. <laughs> yeah, unfortunately, I'm not allowed to share yet. I, all I can say at this point is his TV show, and uh, it'll be coming out before too long. I'll, I'll tell you, once the show actually comes out, I'll tell you all the, the, the details about it. Uh, some fun stuff. But, uh, yeah, unfortunately, I can't divulge details. If I want to keep working, yeah, I can't. But, you know, pretty soon. Pretty soon, I'll, I'll be telling you all about it. But uh, speaking of that, I think I have to get back. So that's it. So I did accomplish it. I did actually get that done. So that's great news. So that means uh, I am down to literally just a couple items left. I need to fix the leaderboard. I need to make you a guest account connect to a Google Play slash Game Center account. And I need to add the technical, uh, the privacy policy crud all that stuff so uh and, and add the obfuscation plug but those are pretty minor that's the last big header no excuse me leaderboard's gonna be a pain leaderboard's still gonna be a pain to get that straight but once that's done we should be in cruise control and pretty close to get this but um yeah if i can find the time i'll do an updated um posting for you guys so you guys can play with the, the newest version i'm in pretty good shape now so if i can make the time i will send out an updated version but either way home stretch man we're so close uh, awesome, can't wait. <laughs> I'll let you know, buddy, I promise. But, uh, yeah, so I'm over time. I gotta head back to the paying gig. Um, but thank you so much, guys. OP Scripter, great to see you again, buddy. I'm glad you made it back. You know, just when I'm about to head out the door again, but, you know, good to see you again. Um, everyone else, thank you so much for hanging out. Uh, my shortened broadcast, I'm sorry. And if I can do a nighttime broadcast, I will, but I'm being, these 10 hours are killing me. Um, <laughs> good to see you. Good to see you too. Take care, buddy. Um, but yeah, so if, if I, the work starts to finish up, then I'll extend the broadcast and all that kind of stuff. But in the meantime, uh, thanks again, guys. Thanks again for hanging out with me and you know, you can see the progress. We're getting really close, but either way, I'll be back, uh, Wednesday, 1 PM Pacific t standard time for my lunch hour broadcast and we'll get this thing done one way or the other. All right, until then, you guys take care, and I'll see you guys soon, all right? Adios.